Welcome back. The Amarillo Fire Department is sending the AMBUS to treat tornado survivors in Matador. Amarillo Fire Department Chief Jason Mays approved a state request to send its ambulance bus to Matador. The AMBUS, a chase vehicle, and seven members of the fire department are expected to provide patient treatment for injuries and transport anyone who needs it. Search and rescue efforts are continuing in Matador after last night's deadly tornado. We have crews in Matador with the latest. Matador residents woke up to a devastating scene this morning. Now it is just about picking up the pieces. Residents here still do not have power, but crews are working diligently to get that back up and running. It is a tragic scene here for Matador residents. The tornado that struck this town last night it is a small knit community. Everyone kind of knows everyone. Multiple agencies are still here rendering aid. Currently, Texas Task Force is on a search and rescue mission. They have not moved into the recovery process just yet. Lubbock Fire and Rescue and DPS said this small knit community allowed them to quickly search for and recover anyone that was missing or injured. We still have that num that confirmed number of four fatalities and 10 total injured. We are still in search and rescue. They are triple checking that no one passing through town was injured when that tornado touched ground. They have just recently brought in the dogs to search through the shrapnel. And we do not know at this time how many have been di displaced from their homes, but there are donations, shelters, and cooling centers open for any residents that are in need of assistance. Back to you in the studio.